everyone welcome to russia's classroom today we are solve a interesting german mass olympiad question our question is x plus y is equal to 6 x y is equal to 4 and we will find out what is the value of x and y in this mass problem it is a easy mass olympiad question uh, this is our first equation and this is our second equation our math solution Our, question, our first equation, it will be x plus y is equal to 6. Now, at this point, if I move on this x in this side, it will be negative x. So, you can see here, y is equal to 6 minus x. This is our third equation. Now, I take our second equation. Our second equation, it will be x, y is equal to 4 then remember that or recall y is equal to 6 minus x so i put this value here so it will be x times 6 minus x is equal to 4 then here 6 times x it will be 6x and x times x it will be x square then here is 4 then if i move on this 4 in this side it will be negative 4 so it will be 6x minus x square then negative 4 is equal to zero then this quadratic equation it will be negative x square positive 6x and negative 4 is equal to zero then at this moment if i multiply both sides by negative 1 we will find out it will be x square minus 6x minus minus it will be plus 4 is equal to zero so we will find out a nice quadratic equation and here a is equal to 1 v is equal to negative 6 and c is equal to 4 then here x it will be minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4 a c over 2 a then at this moment if i put this value here we'll find out easily here is x is equal to what so x it will be minus b so b is negative 6 i take this value here plus minus square root then v square so minus 6 whole to the power 2 minus 4 ac a is 1 and c is 4 over 2 a a is 1 now here x is equal to negative negative it will be positive 6 plus minus square root minus 6 power is even number it is always positive so it will be 36 minus 16 over 2 times 1 will be 2 then here 6 plus minus and a square root 36 minus 16 will be 20 over 2 so we'll find out here x it will be 6 plus minus square root 20 it will be 4 times 5 over 2 then you can see it will be 6 plus minus square root 4 it will be 2 then square root 5 it will be square root 5 over 2 here is no complex number both are real solution then here x if i separate this fraction it will be 6 over 2 plus minus then here 2 square root 5 over 2 then this 6 divide 2 it will be 3 so we'll find out here x it will be 3 plus or minus square root 5 this is our final solution in this math problem but y is equal to what so you can see really here x 1 it will be 3 plus square root 5 and x2 it will be 3 minus square root 5 then here y is equal to what but remember that or recall our third equation first of all we will find out this equation y is equal to 6 minus x this is our first equation now here y <coughs> is equal to 6 minus x sorry here y1 it will be 6 minus x then y2 it will be 6 minus x 
but remember that or recall x is equal to this x is equal to this so it will be 6 minus x x it will be 3 plus square root 5 then here weight it will be 6 minus 3 plus square root 5 then here 6 minus 3 minus square root 5 and here 6 minus 3 then uh, it will be negative negative 5 here so minus minus it will be plus square root 5 then here 3 minus square root 5 6 minus 3 it will be 3 it will be 6 minus 3 it will be 3 and here is plus square root 5 so we'll find out our final answer here x comma y when x is equal to this this time y is equal to this so i take this value 3 plus square root 5 then 3 minus square root 5 when x is equal to this this time y is equal to 3 plus square root 5 so it will be 3 square root 5 comma 3 plus square root 5 so we'll find out our real solution in this mass problem let's check out or let's verify our question x plus y is equal to 6 and xy is equal to 4 this is our question then i take our first equation x plus y is equal to 6 is it right okay let's verify 3 plus square root 5 plus 3 minus square root 5 is equal to 6 is it right this this cancel out 3 plus 3 it will be 6 is equal to 6 so you can see silly here left hand side and right hand side both side is equal but in this expression is it right okay let's verify x y is equal to 4 this is our maths now x x is, is it will be 3 plus square root 5 and y it will be 3 minus square root 5 is equal to 4 now you can see it will be a plus b times a minus b if i apply this mass formula here i mean i mean this is a this is b so a v a b and it will be a square minus b square then a it will be 3 to the power 2 b square it will be square root 5 bracket power is 2 is equal to 4 then here 3 to the power 2 it will be 9 and square root is cancel it will be 5 is equal to 4 then you can see it will be 4 is equal to 4 so left hand side and right hand side both side is equal in this math problem so we'll find out our final solution is x y is equal to 3 plus square root 5 this time y is equal to 3 minus square root 5 when x is equal to 3 minus square root 5 this time y is equal to 3 plus square root 5 thank you all if you enjoy this math olympiad question please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care